Hi, my name is JJ from IBM Maximo Support. And have you ever tried using Migration Manager to migrate automation scripts? And notice that even if you successfully migrated the scripts, there are no launch point data. Well, it's because out of the box, it doesn't automatically determine that the two are related when you do the validation on the migration collection. So it doesn't recommend adding the launch points. Thankfully, it's really easy to fix, and I will show you on this video. First, we create our migration package. So we go to system configuration, migration, and then migration collection. We click on new migration collection. Type in our collection name. So for the sake of this video, I name it test. And click on new row. And now we will select our automation script that we want to migrate. So I already created the script before I start recording the video. And I will select it. And click on return with route. So once it's done, we can save our collection. Then this is the, the part that we will define the related data and look up rules so we can migrate the, the launch point data. So we go to select action, define date related data on lookup rules. Click on new row. Then we will we will add our room name. So any name would do. I'm gonna name it auto launch. Then our primary object should be auto script. Our related object should be script launch point. Then on related columns, we click on new row and add the related columns. So this column should be auto script. Related column should be auto script as well. Then we click on OK. Make sure it's enabled before clicking OK. We can save. And now we can validate our collection. Click on start. Now we would let our validation run on our migration collection. And I'll stop recording the video for now. Then I'll get back once the validation is complete. Now that the validation is complete, you can close it and you can click on refresh. Now, under related configurations, you can search for the related object structure, which is DM launch point. And this will be the only result. You will select the record and click on add related configuration entry to the migration collection. Now you can check on migration collection and see. Now we have two configurations and we can save it. Then you can just create the package and deploy it on your environment.
And now you should be able to migrate your script and the launch point data that's associated with it. And that's it. Thank you.